What is going on guys and girls? My name is James and welcome back today to Roblox. How are you doing everyone? Welcome back, welcome back. Today we continue our journey in My Bee Tycoon and guess who just recorded an entire episode in this wonderful game and forgot to hit the record button. Couldn't be me. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. I'm going to show you what we did because it was cool. So, yeah, firstly, if you missed the first episode, this is a fantastic, fantastic tycoon. It's kind of like a classic style tycoon with lots and lots of modern day twists in here. I've been enjoying playing this so, so much. And as I mentioned, there was supposed to be another episode. Episode, I guess you would call it two. This was supposed to be three, but now it's two because old Jim forgot to click record. It's been a long time since I've done that. And believe me. <laughs> It's a very humbling experience. <laughs> oh, the pain. But anyway, not to worry. We did like a bit of progress and I'll just show you very quickly what we actually did and what we got up to. Um, so yeah, inside here we have our tycoon area. So we've basically just been working on trying to upgrade. Um, so we did get a couple more bees and we actually found out that we could name our bees. So let me introduce you to Martin, to Jeff and to Big Nigel. <laughs> which are currently our three Bs. Uh, we were working here in the lobby a little bit, and the good news is that all of this area, which is where we started, kind of like our main collection areas, these things are all now pretty much done. So we've got our collector here. Let me show you these just in case I didn't. We've got our candy factory with our two sides. We have our chef's kitchen, <laughs> which is really, really sweet. And then if we carry on down here, uh, we have this area, which is like sort of they, they stir honey pots basically to, to generate some honey for us and then if we go around in this direction which is down this side uh we've got some more of the little ploppers here as well um so in terms of this bit of the base that is what we did it gets even better do you remember my very very slow minecart that we were trundling along around in and we didn't think it was quicker than walking speed ladies and gentlemen let me introduce you to Ta -da! <laughs> my ladybug <laughs> So yeah, this is another little thing that I did um, is over on this side. Uh, this is still not finished by any means, but we have a brand new area here for uh, mounts. So we actually haven't finished this bit just yet. Um, but you can see here that we could purchase various different mounts for Robux and or Royal Jelly and or Honey as well. So we've gone with the Ladybug one, which was the cheapest, but it's still probably, I would say, the coolest. <laughs> and we also unlocked an accessory shop and I did a really good Batman impression and it's a shame because now that's gone <laughs> But uh, yeah, you can like accessorize your bees, which is really really cool Don't forget you can like customize your bees. You can change the the patterns on them You can change the color you can change the names you can even put them in Batman clothing What more could you ask for what a fantastic tycoon? <laughs> and we also now have an area here for teleporters. So uh, yeah, we Where's the log cave? Have I even been there? No! Ah! Okay, 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 okay. So I'm really glad that uh, I didn't not record this bit because we uh, showed you like how you can generate is zone number two uh check these guys out look at them look at them <laughs> they're so cute check this one out this is like the bigger one this blue beetle i was thinking like could you imagine a bee swarm instead of having like the the modeling that we had for like the the beetles imagine if they had like modern day modeling do you think it would work or do you think like the classic stuff has to stay i don't know Anyway, we are super, super, super close to leveling up now to going to the, the boss zone. Um, and apparently there's like multiple bosses and stuff. So we need to really check those out. We actually need just one more level. So let's give these guys a... Oh! <laughs> a new area is opened. He's the king of the deep forest. Be careful, bro. Okay, a spider is spawning in a few minutes. Now I'm wondering if this is like a group style boss. Or if I can take it down by myself. Hmm. Time will tell. So it's actually quite good because the more things that you whack, your levels of your beat. But yeah, 
that, like, I've got to say, like, I sort of, in the episode that never was, I basically just talked and chatted, and I was sort of saying that I kind of miss doing YouTube in this way, which was just like, you just played something, um, you know, something like this, a tycoon, whatever. Um, and I was going, like, through the list of some of the older tycoons. I remember there was one where you, like, had an island, <laughs> and you had to, like, build a hotel. And then I was thinking you had, like, um, oh, what was it? You had to build, like, a restaurant? But there was two. There was, like, a restaurant one, and then there was a my restaurant, which was the big games one. And I can't remember the first one. But then again, like, a lot of these things are sort of... Did it happen, or is it just, like, a Roblox fever dream? Like, I'm not too sure, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> but I do miss them. All right, we got one minute here for a spider to spawn. And I need to kill the spider to go to the next zone. Interesting. Okay. I mean, do people want the spider? The spider has spawned! Okay. Let's wait a minute and let's see what happens. Could go really wrong. Could go well. It's a good view from here, though. Look at that. Wow. 30 seconds to go. Yeah, I was wondering, like, because I, I can get on my mount, so I'm wondering if I can just sort of, like, run around and let my bees do the damage. <laughs> it's sort of the cowardly way out, but you know what? It's probably the most effective that we've got, unless I can, like, hardcore parkour on the top of this, maybe? I don't know. There might be some kind of knack to doing it. Time will tell. Here we go, lads. The first boss. It's the spider. I should probably get out my whacker, shouldn't I? All right, we got 200 health as well. Our level goes up, of course. So I think our health does increase slightly. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, it's huge. Yo, look at you. Oh, he's horrible. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. How much damage is he doing? Oh, you know what? I think I could take him. I think I could take him. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've got this in the bag. I've definitely got this in the bag. He's huge, though. Look at the size of him. <laughs> Spitty boy. Get out of here. Kind of reminds me of, like, a Pokemon. Like, uh, what's, what's the, um... The green little spider. Oh, I should know. Am I making that one up or is that a real Pokemon? I think it's real. Anyway, here we go. Come on, get out of here, Mr. Spider. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, we're gonna cruise this, lads. The Sunflower of Justice! Let's go. And three. And two. And one! Yeah! <laughs> you won the battle and you were able to move on to the next area. Let's go on an adventure deeper. Oh, snap. Okay. I mean, I've got a tycoon to build, but it would be rude not to look. Oh, what? <laughs> How cool. Okay, so we do have a hive warp, but I don't think I've built that one yet. Unless I have. So this is our brand new area, and our next zone is level 24. So we have lavas here. Ooh, okay. <laughs> so they've actually got quite a chunky amount of health, but I think they're probably going to give us some good rewards. I'm going to go back to the tycoon in just a second, because I think we'll probably have a decent amount of honey there. So yeah, level 24 is the next goal. We do level up pretty quickly, to be honest, so it's not really a big deal. Um, boom. Fantastic. Look at this place. Okay, level 24 is the next zone. All right, we'll come back here in a second. We'll come back here in a second. Before these flowers. I want to get these flowers. Oh, the big orange ones. I want the orange ones too. <laughs> yeah, I think the orange flowers or like the big flowers in the area tend to give you like a really, really nice boost. And the good thing is it's instant. So they don't despawn straight away or anything like that. Uh, they re respawn anyway very quickly. But they do give you that instant sort of XP. Um, so I'll tell you what, let's go and grab these guys and then we should be level 20. So to be honest, getting to level 24 shouldn't actually be that difficult. Um, there we go, boom, level 20. Now can we use this warp portal or has it not been built yet? It has, yes! Okay, so we can come here instantly now from our hive. Awesome! Now I think this is where we need to continue. Let me go and get the honey. We have 33,000. Okay, that will do for now. I'm still really curious when... Oh! Look. Okay, this is what I was looking for in, in the second episode, which never was. I was wondering why there is...
A clock? Oh, we can't afford you. No. I'll tell you what I'll do. Um, whilst we wait for some more honey to regenerate, I'm going to go and head back to that cave. I'm just going to go and whack a few grubs. <laughs> and I'll meet you guys back in a sec. Okie dokies, still whacking away. So I haven't been back to the hive just yet, but I thought I might as well stay here because we're level 23 and a half. And we're like super, super close now to, to getting to level 24 to get into the new zone, uh, which we might as well do before we go back to the base. Uh, so I've just been casually beaten down on these lavas. They don't know what's hit them. They woke up thinking they'll have a normal day. Then I came rocking down with the old big sunflower. It's not been a good day. Many headaches all around for these lavas. But once again, you feel sort of guilty because the modeling makes them look really cute. Um, so it's almost like you don't want to whack them. You want to kind of give them a bit of a cuddle look. <laughs> they, they, I don't know. Maybe in another life we could have been friends. Lava buddies, lava bros, just sort of blobbing about in the cave. But then again, someone else with the sunflower would then come down and start beating down on us. So, you know, it's not all swings and roundabouts. Grass is not always greener. I don't know what I'm talking about. This should be the last lava. Three, two, one, and boom. Get out of here. Yes, a new area has opened. Okay, let's go and take a little sneaky cheeky look. Uh, and then we should probably head back to the base. If there's some flowers, though, let's go and... Whoa, look at this place. Yo, it's so cool. It's mushrooms. <laughs> Mr. Fungus, hello. All right, so there seems to be like some kind of double layered thing going on there. Ooh, level 37 is a big boss. It's a mole. <laughs> I can see the mole. All right, so 24 to 37, that's going to take a little bit longer, but... Uh, what we'll do whilst we're here is let's just grab the easy things to do. Let's go and head back to the base. We should be okay, though. There's normally three of these per location, but I'm only seeing two. Um, unless there's only two? I'm not sure. Should we see what's up here? How, how does this work? Is this like a teleporter? Teleport. Ah! Oh, there's another zone! What? Okay, so I was thinking, level like 24 to, to, to 37 is a lot, but there is actually a, another zone in between. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Ah, and there's the third one. Cool. So let me go and grab this, and we're going to go and head back to base camp. We should have a nice fat stack. Okay. I really like this game. This game is so cool. Excuse me if I'm repeating myself a little bit, obviously, because I did lose that second episode, but I was sort of just saying a couple times how it's nice because... You do have, like, other things to do while your base, you know, is generating your honey in the background. So, it's kind of like half tycoon, half, like, adventure. Okay, here, wall, and ceiling, honey storage, window, wall, give me some machines, ceiling, 
Honey. Honey. Oh. Oh, yes, finally. <laughs> okay, honey pot. That's what we need. We ran out of money. Hang on. Okay, so we got a little bit more here. Um, and yeah, let's let's go let's go and uh let's go and sort this out quick. I hope whoever's watching that you're enjoying it, something a little bit different, something a bit more chill. Um, yeah, I do really want to just try and throw out some random content. As I said, I love simulators and, and tycoons mostly, uh, just because they're fun and they're chill uh, and they're just enjoyable. So if that's something you would like to see, then then great. And uh, I can't afford this third honeypot, but I will. Uh, and yeah, we'll carry on next episode. We've got plenty more still to do, I think. Um, so until then, thanks. And see you.